Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. This is GGF, bringing you episode one of a new Let's Try. So, being that it's going on December here, and um, I'm kind of in the mood to try a bunch of different games, and I don't really hand select the games all that much. Like, I just kind of go on a whim. I see something in my games like that I own or that I purchase and I see something and it, it clicks with me and boom we're playing it so that's what we're doing today this is a game um, on my old Fluence World channel I had an LP of this of the original version of this that went for mm, I don't know maybe 10 episodes or so um, but this is the enhanced edition essentially which I have never played so basically this is an indie strategy RPG with a cool story and some interesting mechanics, very detailed and complex mechanics. And we're jumping in here to Telepath Tactics Liberated. So as I said, I have not played the Liberated version. I've just played the regular Telepath Tactics, so this should be interesting. We'll go ahead and hit play, made by Sinister Design. He's a nice guy. I've talked to him over the years <coughs> on various sites and about his games and stuff. He makes some cool strategy RPGs and stuff like that. So, so uh, we're going to go on this journey together, guys. I hope you join me. Let's settle in a little bit here and relax and enjoy some telepath tactics. Sinister design. <laughs> That's new. I've never seen that before. All right, let's go ahead and hit settings. Um... New on combat zoom, screen shake, mouse and keyboard, everything looks good. Very good, very good. Let's just go ahead and hit new game. Um, this I thought was pretty interesting when I fired this up earlier. There's actually other campaigns you can play, um, which is pretty cool. We might try some of them at some point. There's options to mess around with that. Not a ton of them, and some of these are just like you know the modable base campaign but um pretty cool i didn't see that before in the regular version we're going to be playing um the vengeance of emma strider the strider sisters leave behind the tribe of licit who raised them determined to rescue their father from enslavement at the hands of the corrupt vibra mining company the randomizer is the same main campaign except it replaces the main cast with a selection of procedurally generated characters you'll get totally different characters in every run so we're just going to play the base Vengeance of Emma Strider. Proceed. Um, Amziga, I don't know what that is, but we'll go ahead and save over that. Uh, very good, very good. Oh, are we into it already? Uh, welcome to Telepath Tactics. Before we begin, what difficulty would you like to play on? I looked at this earlier and I thought maybe Soldier, Competent Enemy AI... Fallen characters return, but they have minus one max health versus ruthless enemy AI. Fallen characters die permadeath, so and it gets harder from that. So I'm gonna go with soldier because I'm a wuss. <laughs> permadeath is a little too much for me, I think. Um, but minus one max health still, you know, makes it where to where you don't want to lose characters in combat. You have selected Soldier Difficulty, recommended for players who want a decent challenge and lasting consequences for their mistakes, but not permadeath. Are you sure? Confirm. Alright, cool. At last, the Tsarist. Amziga, it has been so long. If only I could stay a while, but they must surely have sensed me by now. Amziga. Amber, Amber Song. Sorn, Sorn Kamina, is that you? It's all up to the Ka now. Goodbye, little ones. I must fly. <laughs> Very cool wording there. Some Lord of the Rings Tolkien for you. Ten years later. Player's turn. Solithus Predat. Lift your Kala, Hesh. I have a name. Your name will be Gadur if you keep leading with your feet during your attack. Sa. Uh. 
You see, what do I tell you, Hesh? You must always lead with the Sarah or leave yourself open to a killing blow. She pants with exhaustion. My name is Emma. Tch, you make such slow progress. You are Hesh until you improve. Try again. Welcome to Telepath Tactics. In this battle, you control Emma Strider, the blue swordsman on the left. Left click to select her. Already, I see the graphics are very pretty. Um, they are upgraded, it seems. Okay, let's go ahead and click her. Every space Emma can move to is highlighted in blue. Click a blue space next to move there. Um, I don't know. Go behind him. Is that a possibility? C, moving is easy. Now end your turn by pressing the end turn button in the actions bar below. We'll get into all this as we go. Rotate. Oh, so it does matter. Okay, so we'll hit end turn. Spectator's turn, player's turn. We can save the game. That's interesting. Enough hesitation. Draw your Sarah and attack me. Skills are shown on the left side of the action bar at the bottom of the screen. Move the mouse over a skill button to see what it does and what spaces it can reach. Click sword, the skill in the bottom left now. Let's see. Basic sword attack. The red spaces show where your attack can reach. Click the red space where Solithus is standing to attack her. Minus two, 100% accuracy. Oh, nifty. There's counterattacks. All your characters have finished acting in the turn. Now, defend! Going behind me. Mace. Boom. Backstabbed. Huh. Sloppy. Suzette Gator. Galan Hesh. Panting. You know that I can understand you, right? So you understand, Lissit. What you do not understand is that weakness in combat will get you killed. Come, attack again. Try this time. Player's turn. Okay, let's, um... Come down here and click sword and... Yeah, we're definitely not winning this battle, but... Cool music, too. Boom. In trouble. She eyes Emma with a look of unguarded disappointment. Here, use bandage. To use an item, right-click Emma. This will open her character screen. Her inventory will appear at the bottom left of the character screen. Click the bandages and select use. So if we look at that hover over there, 3 out of 33 HP... One out of one attacks with the sword, I guess. Eight energy or something, and five out of five movements. So let's right click. Oh, nice. And here we see what it is. Yep, energy, capacity to pay energy cost of skills. Oh, counter attacks, ability to retaliate against attacks. Very nice little character sheet. Nice to see there's some sort of an inventory. Practice sword, 18 uses left. Strength minus one. Determines physical damage dealt by physical attacks. Bandages two uses left. Health plus 12. Restores health. Flimsy practice sword. Strength minus one. We'll get into this more later. Her morale is adequate. Level of emotional commitment to the fight. Minus 10 to plus 10. That's pretty cool. Resistances. Slash. Pierce. Crush. Mental. Heat. Cold. Poison. Shadow. Light. Awesome. Level 1 Hero, a balanced, versatile frontline skirmisher with solid offenses and defenses. Equipment Mastery, Sword, Main Gauche, Light Armor, Small Shield. Ooh, so even armor and stuff is in the game. Nice. Types of weapons armor the character can equip. Accuracy, base chance for hits to attack. Dodge, base percentage chance to avoid enemy attacks. Perception, how far the unit can see through Fog of War. Reflexes, ability to turn and face attacks before they hit, that's interesting. Psy, determines the power of Psy skills, that's cool. Um, yeah, very cool. So perception and dodge, okay. And let's go ahead and use the bandages, and we could use give, drop, or go, oh, that's cool. I like the artwork here too, let's use them. And uh, do we still have an attack?
Boom. We are done. Rest. Reflect on your form. We try again tomorrow. Sabrina Strider. Damn. Emma, are you okay? She rubs her neck, grimacing in pain. I'll be fine. Silithus was really hard on you today. Yeah, what else is new? So, um, do you want to practice some more? Right now? Are you kidding? Oh, come on. I hardly ever get any sparring time. Silithus always focuses on you because you're older. Okay, look. It feels like a tree just fell on me. You want me to be ready when we go rescue Dad, don't you? Shh, not so loud. Do you want us to get caught? Sorry. It's okay. Look, I need to go rest, and you do too. Try not to worry. I'll see you tonight. Cool, little cutscenes and stuff. You're late. Sorry, it took longer than I thought it would to find a sword. They must have moved that bandit stockpile sometime over the past few weeks. It's fine. Let's get going. We need to put some distance between us and the Zaris before daybreak. Hold on a second. What? I feel a little weird about this. Shouldn't we at least say goodbye? Sabrina, we've been over this. The Lysit will try to stop us if we tell them. I just feel weird leaving the Zaris behind without so much as a word. I feel like I'm turning my back on my home. This isn't your home. It's like we're leaving our family behind. Don't say that. What is wrong with you? Well, they basically raised us, didn't they? Look at me. I am your family. Father is your family. Family doesn't call you Hesh every other word. I guess. Pull it together, Sabrina. We waited too long to give up on this now. If you don't want to come, then go run back to the Zaris. I'm going to go rescue Father. Hey, hey, Emma, wait up! Oh, this is going to be fun, guys. I'm in the mood for something like this. So, where are the mines exactly? I don't know. That's what we're going to find out. Um... Don't worry, we'll find out where they are. We're not going to the Hesh Town, are we? First of all, don't call it the Hesh Town. It's just town. Second of all, why wouldn't we? Well, you know, Ambir Sang Song says... I don't care what Ambir Sang says. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to yell. Look, no one from the Zaris would say how we ended up there, or how to get back to the mines. So we have to ask around ourselves. Someone in town is bound to know something. Look at that, Red. Two young ladies traveling all alone. This should be an easy one. Zash. Well, the boss will be happy to hear about it. Aw, oh, we don't need to bother the boss. We can take care of this ourselves. Uh... Relax. Pharaoh won't have to know nothing. It's... it's not that. What, are you scared or something? No, it's just they have armor and weapons, looks like. And there's only two of us. So what? A scrawny girl in armor is still just a scrawny girl. Come on, don't be such a chicken. I'm not a chicken, I'm just... Hey, wait up. Oh boy. Well, well, didn't your daddies ever tell you not to travel alone in Igor's territory? Emma, bandits. Don't worry, we're not all that bad. Just pay us a little tribute and you'll be free to leave. They will? Ah, would you shut up? Get back, Sabby. You'll stay right where you are if you know what's good for you. Oh, we're not going anywhere. You two, on the other hand, Emma draws her sword. Player's turn, here we go. Can't save. Alright, so we can go in any order. We have Sabrina, who has much more energy. And we have stuff here like Terrain Inspector, Open Door, Use, Talk, Grab, Rotate, Undo, Enter, and Menu. Um, Terrain Inspector? Oh, Dirt, Dirt, Grass, Grass, Tree, can only fly over it. Hmm. Alright, let's... Oh, wait, before we, before we move, do we right click? Oh no, right click. <laughs> that brings up the tree resistances and stuff, that's pretty wild. 
Um, actually, let's see. Place snare trap. Place a trap that stuns, doesn't end the turn. And sword. Okay, let's place a snare trap. No, wait, I don't want to do that. Um, we've got... What do we, who do we have here? We've got red or Zash, level 1 axe fighter. Frontline fighter with big damage output but weak defense. And level 1 axe fighter, red. Who's got 5 strength and Zash has 6 strength. So we'll snare trap Zash. Come here. Tutorial, you now have both sisters under your control. You can move and attack with both of them during every turn. Left click Emma to select her. You can also use the space bar to cycle through your available characters. Yeah, we'll get there. Let's place a snare trap. Oh wait, it doesn't end the turn. So wait a minute, can I undo that? I can. But actually, there's no point to undo. Put a snare trap there. And there's not much she can do. Um, Emma. If I come up here, he may come over here and miss the snare trap, but we'll try it anyway. Don't forget, whenever you're done moving with everyone, if there are characters left that you don't want to attack with, you can just select end turn from the action bar. You can also press the E key while holding shift. Don't forget, whenever you're done moving with everyone, if there are characters left... Oh. Okay, let's um, hit sword and minus six. Boom. Ooh, level up for Emma. Ooh, learn new skill sprint. Gain 3% dodge. This is nice. Two counterattacks, it looks like. Interesting. And sprint, reach level 2. Sprint, element shield, 100% accuracy, 2 energy, 40% of speed added to max movement this turn, doesn't end the turn. Oh, that's speed, not movement. Okay, that's pretty cool then. Alright, nice. And Sabrina can just wait and we'll end the turn bloodbeards bandits oh <laughs> stunned all right let's see here um I want to try. I want to kind of do something clever. What I'm thinking is, no, let's just uh, attack here. We laid the trap, which is pretty good. We'll kill him. Why is this happening to me, mommy? Turn. Come Sash. Oof. Alright, I want to get Savvy some XP. I oh, should have had her finish him off. Alright, that'll about do it. Ooh. Ugh, can't believe she beat me. <clears throat> Almost another level. Two felled, no casualties, 40 damage dealt, 12 taken, 3 turns taken, no sacks grabbed, no bonus points, 206 score. Nice. Very cool. Yeah, this is going to be fun, guys. I'm definitely in the mood for something like this. So this is a tavern. The Bramblebriar, whatever that means. It sure is noisy in here. I think I like it. Ah, Crucius. This is making me think of Dad. He took me to a tavern once when I was really little. The music, the chatter, the warm lighting, I'd forgotten all about it. She sighs heavily. He's counting on us, Sabby. Let's split up and see what we can find out. Oh, cool. Hi, my name is Emma. 
Gavriel Hashmo. Lo, my name is Gavriel. Lo? I'm sorry, Farsat Hashmo. I'm sorry, please forgive us. My sister has a strange sense of humor. <laughs> it's just simple wordplay, Farsat. I don't get it. Low, hi. <laughs> hi, low. Well, you see, you said hi, which sounds like hi. So I responded by saying low. It doesn't work so well if you have to explain it. <laughs> right, so maybe you can help me out. I'm looking for a certain place. You don't say, so are we. Gabrielle, a word please. Excuse us, Emma. Louise Ledger Domain. Hi, it's so good to see you. What, huh? Goodness, I'm so sorry. You look just like my friend. I mistook you for her. Oh, well, um, that's all right. I'm so embarrassed. Can I buy you a drink? Well, okay, why not? Here, have a seat. My name is Louise. This is, or Louise, this is my associate, Madeline. Nice to meet you. I'm Sabrina. A pleasure to meet you, Sabrina. Madeline, would you be a dear and buy our new friend a beer? I have to be honest, I've never had beer before. Here, try some. It's cheap swill, but it does the trick. Uh, thank you. Ah, this takes, uh, tastes awful. Don't let first impressions fool you. You have to give beer time. It grows on you. Yeah, on your gut. She slaps her belly. <laughs> Blech. To be honest with you, I don't know if I'm ever going to like this stuff. A good beer is one of life's little pleasures. I wonder what else you've never tried before. Have you ever played Guess a Number? No, what is that? Oh, you'll absolutely love it. It's great fun. Here's how it works. You pick a number, any number, and I try to guess what you've picked. Let's try it. Think of a number. All right. Hmm, you're thinking of 15. No, I'm sorry. I was thinking of two. Trat. Okay, let's try again. Think of a new number. Tell me when you have it. All right, got it. Your number is 37. Or no, it was 21. Damn, I guess I'm not very good at this. Hey, Sabrina, maybe you should bet some money on the outcome of the next one. What? Are you trying to ruin me, Madeline? I'll tell you what, we'll keep it small. Say, a hundred aura. Oh, uh, to be honest, I don't really ha- Don't spoil it, Sabrina. We were just having so much fun. Besides, what are the chances of me actually guessing right? Well, you are zero for two. Indeed I am. Come on, think of a number. Okay, I have it. It's eight. What? But how did you... Pure luck, dear. Pure luck. Anyway, you've lost the bet, so now it's time to pay up. But I don't have any money. I was trying to tell you. Oh, oh my. That is unfortunate. What did you say so, Madeline? You know what I always say, Louise. If you ain't got a fortune, you're unfortunate. <laughs> ha. Hmm. Hmm, yes. Well, we shan't let a little thing like debt come between friends, right, Sabrina? Oh, good. I was worried you were... You can work it off. What? What is it, Farasat? We don't know this girl. Perhaps it would be best not to trust her with the purpose of our quest. If you're that concerned, why don't you just read her mind? Really? You're really suggesting that? What? Why not? It's just the two of us. We could use some help, and she looks like she's handy with a sword. One doesn't simply go around reading people's minds, Gabrielle. It's rude. You're so fussy. If it were me, I'd be reading people's minds all the time. All the time. <laughs> Excuse me, hi. You can continue your argument in a moment. I just need to know if the location of... If you know the location of the Viber Mines. There, you see Farsat? She's heading there too. Gabrielle. So you're heading to the mines? Yes, our dear brother was kidnapped and sold to the Shadowlings. We aim to free him. Yawa, help us, Gabrielle. That mouth of yours is going to get us killed one of these days. Yawa, Yawa, help us. Yawa, help us. Not today, not by me. My sister and I seek the mines for a similar reason. Hey everyone, run for your lives! It's Bloodbeer's Bandits! Uh oh. 
Gunther Lathe. It's harvesting time. You know the drill. Round up the men first. Kill anyone who gives you trouble. Fira expects us back with our catch by tomorrow, so let's do this fast and efficient-like. Emma! Sabrina, over here! Is this your friend? She's my sister. Do you have business with her? After a fashion. Well, it'll have to wait. Come on, Sabrina. We can't just stand idly by while this village is ransacked by bandits. Okay, we've got a full party. Hey, wait up. We're going to help you. Are these the bandits the villagers kept talking about? They have shackles with them. Hmm, as I thought. Slavers. If they sell slaves to the mines, they must know how to get there. We should try to capture one of them. The mines? <laughs> Oh my, you're all mad. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, who are you? No one you need to concern yourself with, Ravenalian. Hey Louise, these guys have axes and they're heading for us. Maybe we should, you know, focus on that for now. Well, you don't have to axe me twice. Ha <laughs> ha. Yo, wa, help us. <laughs> Bloodbeer Bandit's turn. Okay, here we go. I'm a little stuffed up, guys. Hope you don't mind too much. Okay, we've got a line of three, and then four, and then five. Tutorial. At the start of your turn, there will be a save game button in the bottom left of the new turn box. To save your product progress mid-battle, click the save game button before dismissing the new turn box. Mm-hmm. So we do want to save, of course, episode one, so one. And we can't type anything, it looks like, so we'll just hit proceed. All right. Your swordsmen and axe wielders have more health than your other characters, and they'll counterattack when hit. Keep them up front as much as possible. To see what a character on your team is capable of, right-click on them. Okay, so I want to see how long we've been playing. 27 minutes only, okay. All right, let's look. Uh, we know Sabrina can set traps and fight with a sword. Um, what about Louise? Louise Ledger Domain, level one mentalist, no counter attack. She can use light armor. She's got mind shield, heal the target in a range of zero to two for twelve HP, costing three energy, which she has twenty of. Mind Blast, 12. Um, Twelve of uh, Slashing? Slashing Light? Basic Mental Attack always hits, range of 1, and she's got Focus Pills, 2 uses left, energy plus 12 restores energy. Um, one second, guys. Be right back. Alright, we are back, guys. Let's, uh, let's do it. So she's a mentalist, level 4 axe fighter, Madeline Strongarm. She does have a counter attack and she's got 10 strength. And she can use axe, which does, again, 10 uh, slash, I guess. I don't know what that lit up sword is. Not seeing that anywhere. It says 10 there. She's also got throwing axes, 5 uses left, strength plus 6, and bandages. 45 uses of her Iron Axe, Ordinary Iron Axe. Then we've got Farasat Hashmal, level 1 Photokineticist, no counterattack. Energy 20, um, Light Blast, base 50% chance to cause blinded, cannot be counterattacked. And Mind Blast, basic mental attack always hits. This has a range of 2 to 3, which is cool. Um, I wanted to check though. So he's got minus 30% slash, so he's going to take more slashing damage. He has 15% mental resist, 25% light resist. I didn't check anyone else. Um, Luis has great reef. Oh, that's Psy. Not great reflexes. She has some Psy, though. Or, yeah. 40% mental resist, and she also takes more slashing damage. And uh, Madeline... Doesn't have any resist, no reflexes, no sigh. Just pure strength for her and Farasat. 
We saw him. He does have some sigh. No reflexes. Sabina had the reflexes. Oh, no, she doesn't either. Just a little bit of sigh. And then Gabrielle Hashmal, level 1 bowman. She has a counterattack with a bow. Ability to retaliate against attacks. And she's got bow. Damage 9, I guess. Basic bow attack can move after using. 2-4 to four range. Ordinary iron bow. And, of course, Emma. Mmm... We're not in a great position. Let's see what they are. Level 1 Axe Fighter. Oh, they're all level 1 Axe Fighters. Level 1 Bowman. Um. <sighs> Mind Shield heals basic mental attack. Um. Wait, I want to see how far they can move. Is it going to show me? Yes. Alright, so you move back out of the way a little bit. You move back out of the way. Back out of the way. You guys... We'll just end our turn like this. I should have laid a trap. Hmm. There's more of them. Must try to reach level 3. 5% slash resist. Learn new skill shove. 3% dodge gain. And shove, element of falling. Push the target one space. And pull, pull the target backward one space. Interesting. New skill pull. Bowman attacking. Oh, she was backstabbed. I didn't rotate her. That's my bad. Should have put a trap there. In this fight, you will lose if Emma or Sabrina falls. To review victory and loss conditions, click the options button, then click show objectives. Use bandages and Louise's mind shield ability to heal wounded characters. Okay. Madeline. You come up here and... Minus 10. Boom. Um, Sabrina... Let's see, wait a minute here. Um, the this, this snare doesn't end the turn, so let's put a snare right there. See, we should have been a little bit better off here. And then rotate her. Can we rotate her? Ooh, level 2, 5% slash resist, 1 strength, learn new skill sprint. Nice. Turn is over, so I guess we can't rotate her. Then we've got Emma. Um, let's take our Bowman, Gabrielle, and maybe... Oh, I'll have to attack in a line. I come here and nice. All right, how far can you move? Okay, far enough. Um, I want a two. Also want a line. No, that's not going to do. Oh, you wait, you can go right here and do a two. What a waste. And an item sack with gold in it. Emma can grab. Hmm. Emma actually can come over here and do a sword attack on you, who should be stunned by all rights. And you do a mind attack or mind shield. Um, what's 
her HP at right now? 12. She takes a shot from him. Or her. Damage 6. Um, let's try something. Let's try taking you there. And doing a Mind Blast. Nice. Boom. And take our Bowman up. Gabrielle. And she can... Oh, she can't grab the sack. I, okay. Uh, rotate. R. There we go. And end turn, I guess. Here we go. Hmm. That snare goes unused. Oh, dang. He picked up the sack. You sack grabber, you. Player's turn. We don't really need to save. Attacks that can hit multiple ranges like Light Blast or Bow experience damage fall off as you target farther away. These attacks deal their base damage at minimum range, then deal 15% less damage for each space beyond that you target the attack. If you can do so safely, it's best to attack at minimum range. Okay, so we'll bring you here and... attack and you um, can mind blast I just don't want her being taken out um, or if I bring you here and you do a two oops one second guys what a waste Sorry guys, I accidentally, uh, dropped my light. All right. Nice. XP4. Barasat gains two energy, 5% shadow resist, no skills. Um, she can go ahead and grab a sack, but then heal herself. Nice mind shield, cool. And Emma, alright, let's see. Madeline. Boom. Very nice. Uh, let's put a snare right there. And just in turn have Emma come right here and rotate and turn. What the hell is going on over there? Did the villagers hire mercenaries? Ugh, damn those muck encrusted pig fondlers. Fear is going to have my head. Fall back, fall back, you dogs. Victory. Very nice. Felled five. We didn't grab a sack, I guess. Did I have to press a button on it, maybe, that I didn't? Oh, auto, -loot, auto looted two loose item sacks. 32 damage taken. 101 dealt. No casualties. Nice. Very, very nice. They've retreated. We should follow them. What's this? Oh. Yeah, let's ask them how it was. I've always wanted to go on a retreat. Follow them on purpose? Are you daft, dear? We're lucky to be alive right now. I concur. Thank you. With Emma, I mean. After all these months of searching for our brother, I am not prepared to let the trail go cold. Right, the bandits will give us a chance to learn the location of the mines. Come on, Sabrina. What? Hey, now wait just a minute. <laughs> oh, look, Emma, what is that? Is that a caravan? You've never seen a caravan before? Oh, that's adorable. Your sister is just precious, Emma. Wait, do you hear that? It sounds like fighting. It doesn't just sound like it. The caravan is under attack. 
More bandits. The guards are outnumbered. We should intervene. Whoa, whoa. Emma, is it? This isn't your fight, dear. There's no need to risk your neck over a quarrel between thieves and merchants. Are you serious? People are getting killed down there. And how does adding ourselves to the corpse pile help that, hmm? We already did our good deed for the day by saving the people of Adelbray. I say we cut our losses and skirt around this little dust-up. I vote to help. We're not going to find out the location of the mines by running away from every bandit we see. Well, you're not going to find it out by dying, either. Since you're not from around here, I feel I should point out that this is a small island. Igor Bloodbeard is going to take notice of you if you keep attacking his bandits, and then he is going to hunt you down. I am all for caution, but I cannot stand to sit by and watch these guards get slaughtered like this. We have to do something. Let's form up. We can debate our next course of action once we've handled this. In most battles, you have the opportunity to deploy characters. During deployment, click characters, then click the yellow spaces to decide what formation they'll begin battle in. Press the done button once you've placed everyone where you want them. Interesting. Okay, so here we are. Um, there are so many bandits. So many. Even a... Oh, that's a guard. Alright, so... Supplies recall done. Let's see. Madeline, run on the front lines. Sabrina. Emma. Gavrielle. Farasat, Luis, um, something like that. Let's check our supplies. Uh, sort weapons. We don't have anything. I have to remember she has throwing axes and she has a rusty sword, a rusty old sword. Rusty old sword. Alright, cool. I guess that's it. Alright, we're done. Let's get into it. Caravan guards turns. Let's see what they muster. Not bad. Cool music. Actions. Scarlet Etoile. Player's turn, let's save the game as episode one. Those guards won't last long out there if we don't get them to coordinate with us. Sabrina, let's try talking to them. Sometimes Emma and Sabrina can talk to other characters during battle. To begin a conversation, move one of them next to that character. A talk button will appear in the actions menu. Click it, then click the character to begin talking. So we can talk to that one and that one. So let's add, and have Sabrina. Oh, this is tricky. Can attack there. All right, let's have Sabrina come here, place a trap here, and then keep going over that way. Could even sprint. I don't think they're going to survive long enough for us to get to them. Move bonus. We can try different things, though. Um, I don't know why I did it that way. Emma. Come up here. Alright, and uh, can't talk, can sprint, um, guess we'll come up here, and we'll bring Farasat right here, rotate him, and we'll bring Louise, um, have those guys sit back here and uh, let's end the turn and see how it goes mm. 
did not counter. I'm gonna hit my water bottle, guys. Please bear with me. We'll never get there in time. Wow. Use bandages, nice. Can you run? Alright, that's not too bad. That works. Lakshmi Bana. May the Watcher guide you on your journey. Lakshmi. We gotta get to you, Lakshmi. Lance. Scarlet Etoile. Etoile. Um, okay. That snare is useless. Talking to characters is a free action. You continue, can continue with your character's turn afterwards. If you see the talk button in the actions menu, it's usually to your advantage to click it. So come here. Let's go ahead and talk. Uh, they just keep recruiting them younger and younger. Run home, child. I don't want to kill you. Well, you needn't worry. I'm no bandit. The name's Emma. We're here to help. This is no place for heroes, Emma. It's not much of a place for a badly outnumbered caravan guard, either. What do you say we fight them together? All right, let's see what you can do. Scarlet has been recruited. Notice that she has turned blue. This means that you can now command her directly. Nice. Okay, but Emma, I want to... I wonder what would happen if we would shove him into that one. I'm curious, but I don't want to waste my turn. Um, probably won't do as much damage as a basic sword attack would. Can she move anywhere else? No. Um, let's see. Okay, it does do good damage. Nice. And Scarlet. come here and finish off that one beautiful and then protect her flank I guess and you get up there it's a snare trap Oh, sprint. Yeah, you can sprint again. Nice. Nasty. Ooh. Second counterattack. 3% dodge. Learn shove and pull. Nasty. Let's go up here and talk. Get back, or I swear to the Watcher, I will gut you. Whoa, hey, calm down. We're on your side. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know who you are, but thank you for the help. Don't sweat it. Let's just uh, save the gutting for the bad guys. Recruited Lakshmi Bana. Very cool. Um, Lakshmi. Bayonet. Basic bayonet attack. Element crossbow. Okay, so let's... Oh, they all have full health. Hmm. Minus eight. Let's take Lakshmi. Oh, she can't move. Turn is over. Dang, that snare's not a good place either. Oh, I don't like that at all. Let's actually bring her... Ah, I don't know. Let's, let's try something here. Uh, we still have these guys down here. Let's just bring Madeline up. You're about to move one of your own traps? No. Come there and then move up there. And Louise, get behind her. And our bowman. Gabrielle, come here. Little 
Plate Blast. That should be good. Um, do I want to move here? Yeah, I think so. Alright, let's end the turn. Very good, very good. Fun stuff so far. <clears throat> really enjoyable. Max attack, little counter. So she has two counter attacks in case she gets attacked twice in a turn, is how it works. I get that. Scarlet has none, it looks like. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, snare trap, son. Finally got one that worked. Alright, cool. Well, you're gonna catch Madeline's hands. Nice. We can save. Um, it might be time to call it an episode. It is 51 minutes in, so gonna end here, guys. Oh, to get to far off places on the battlefield quickly, have Emma and Sabrina use Sprint. This will boost their moment, movement for the rest of the turn. If you're ever unhappy with a move, click the undo button. You can undo multiple moves in a row, just as long as no one's attacked, used an item, or stumbled into a trap. Cool, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this opening episode. I am totally in it. Definitely feeling this right now. Hope you guys will join me for it. As far as we go with this Let's Try, going to be a lot of fun. So hope to see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Be well, live well, stay well, guys. And much love and peace and joy to all of you. And uh, don't go anywhere because we have a very cool game here to check out. Going to be a lot of fun. So see you guys next time.